toughest looking test to date for the Nigerian nightmare, as he calls himself. Heavy handed Samuel Peter, only 24 with 20 straight wins and emerging as one of the best hopes of the new generation. Up in class against the uh, Californian Jeremy Williams, who's always had a little bit of talent and ability, although his uh, punch resistance has been found wanting on occasion. It could be a shootout here, Glenn. Well, it'll certainly tell us a little bit more about Samuel Peter as he goes through the, the heavyweight rankings. Has got a, a very good punch, but at what level? This uh, a level up from what he's really been campaigning at. He's also coming off a couple of 10-round decisions, so uh, as he moves up, will that power have the same effect? Also uh, carrying a little extra weight around the midriff, but both men know how important this is. For one, the up-and-comer with uh, the world at his feet, and for Williams, surely a last chance. He's got to win this. Yes, he does, or his career is going nowhere. Peter has got fast hands, throwing out the, the double jab, and certainly a bit of variety in there. Williams, who has remained unbeaten in his last eight fights, but beaten nobody of note during that time lost in three rounds to Henry Akin one day for the uh, world title many years ago but this is a time Glenn when the heavyweight division bar Vitali Klitschko remains wide open yes it does certainly for a youngster of 24 like Peter he doesn't look very fast of foot but he's got good hand speed Based here in Las Vegas, Samuel Peter and his uh, team have really high hopes. They've been uh, calling out anyone in the uh, top ten of the division already. Remember, he's still 24, so there's plenty of time. Yeah, he's not really even matured into a, to a heavyweight yet. He's big, he's strong. Really need to see what he's like when he gets hit on the, on the chin. Williams trying desperately to uh, remember how to get his own shots off, but he's wobbled there, and I think Peter sensed it. Hurt Jeremy Williams at the end of the first round and slowly walks back to his corner. Yes, he looks a little bit dazed as he sits on his stool. Jeremy Williams took a, a good shot in that round from Peter. Get inside. Let your punches go, don't reach, all right? First impressions of Peter? Well, certainly, you know, quite impressed by the, the fast hands. A little over to, to right hands there, Williams didn't quite get it on. Here's the second heavyweight division. American colours of the man originally from Iowa, Long Beach, Jeremy Williams, now 32 up against the uh, unbeaten hope Samuel Peter from Nigeria and a left hook bang on the button that's good night fight over there and then I don't know why they're bothering to count he is absolutely out cold Jeremy Williams frightening power there from Samuel Peter and the uh, doctors are, are straight in to 10 to Jeremy Williams and uh, first concerns surely and only for the safety of the fighter but uh, my word he can hit well let's hope Jeremy Williams is okay but it was a, a tremendous left hook he just dropped his hands Williams as he moved away and Peter quick to just turn around get the angle set his feet and let that left hook go and tremendous power seven of his first nine fights 
ended inside a round, and this okay. one in the Come second. Good news is that uh, uh, Jeremy Williams is uh, just him, him, being helped up. He looks, thankfully, absolutely fine. We saw a knockout a while back, a little bit like that when uh, Takalu was blown away by Wayne Alexander. Well, everyone loves a heavyweight that can punch. Samuel Peter can do that. Let's follow his progress. Yep, he is a big man with fast hands, 24 years of age, and certainly in in the heavyweight division where there's not a lot about, there looks a future for Samuel Peter.